Amazing facts. The world's most popular sport. Football is the most popular international team sport. It is much more popular than American football, basketball, or baseball. FIFA, Federation Internationale de Football Association. The worldwide football organization has approximately 7.1 million teams in 301,000 clubs, with 265 million players around the globe. It has more members than the United Nations. The World Cup is one of the most spectacular sporting events in the world. Every four years, over a billion people follow the month-long competition between the top 32 football-playing nations on TV. The World's Most Expensive Hotel The Burj Al Arab Hotel in Dubai is the world's only seven-star hotel. The hotel is an architectural wonder. It looks like a huge sail. Its height is 1,053 feet, 321 meters, making it one of the world's tallest buildings. The Burj Al Arab, Arabian Tower, is built on a human-made island. It is the world's most luxurious hotel. It features marble and glass from Italy, 24 karat gold-plated faucets and doorknobs, mirrors that turn into TV screens in the bathrooms, rotating beds, and all the latest technology. The cheapest suite is more than $1,000 per night, and the most expensive suite can cost over $18,000. The Great White the world's most dangerous fish. The great white shark is one of the oldest living species on Earth. It existed 350 million years ago. It is the largest and the most dangerous predatory fish, and it is the most feared by humans. Great white sharks can grow up to 20 feet, 6 meters long, and weigh up to 4,400 pounds, 2,000 kilograms. They have about 3,000 teeth arranged in several rows. When the front teeth break or fall out, these teeth are replaced by others from the next row. Sharks' hearing is very sensitive, and they can hear their prey many miles away. They can also detect one part per million of blood in seawater. Did you know? Tokyo is bigger than Shanghai or Mexico City. It's the world's biggest and most crowded city. The banana is the most popular fruit in the world. Diamonds are the world's hardest elements and the most expensive precious stones. The Arabian oryx is one of the most endangered species in the Arabian Peninsula. It was extinct in the wild in the 1970s, but it was saved by zoos and reintroduced to its habitat. The peregrine falcon is the fastest moving creature on Earth. It can dive at speeds of up to 200 miles, 320 kilometers, per hour. Which is the world's most dangerous fish? It's the great white shark. Is Mexico City bigger than Tokyo? No, it isn't. It's smaller.
Welcome to the Van Meer Diamond Company. Before I show you how we cut diamonds, let me tell you a little about the stones. Diamonds are formed over a period of a billion or more years deep within Earth's crust, about 150 kilometers deep, and are gradually pushed to the surface. Diamonds are the hardest natural substance on Earth, but if you hit a diamond with a hammer, it will break into many pieces. Also, if you place a diamond in an oven and raise the temperature to about 763 degrees Celsius, it will simply disappear, not leaving even a little ash. The world's largest diamond was the Cullinan, found in South Africa in 1905. It weighed 3,106.75 carats, uncut. When they found it, the rough diamond was 10 centimeters long, 6 centimeters high, and 5 centimeters thick. It was cut into nine large gemstones and many smaller fragments. The largest of the cut diamonds is called the Great Star of Africa and weighs 530.2 carats, 106 grams. The lesser star of Africa is 317.4 carats. These diamonds now belong to the British crown, and they form part of the world's biggest collection of jewels. The Cullinan Diamond Collection is estimated to be worth over $400 million. Now follow me and let's see how Better, faster, hotter, stronger. Summer is better than winter. Is a cheetah faster than a horse? So, what's new? I bought myself a computer. What kind? A laptop. Laptops are friendlier to use and are cheaper than other computers. Does it have internet? Not yet. I'm going to install that next week. I don't like laptops. I prefer desktops. Desktops are easier to use, especially if you have to write and print a lot. Laptops, you have to recharge them all the time, and their screen is much smaller. I don't agree. Laptops are the best. You can surf the net, send emails, and play games anywhere. You don't have to wait until you get home. Well, I still think desktops are much more convenient than laptops. Yeah, but you can't take one with you. Still standing. The Romans built arenas, theaters, bridges, aqueducts, and roads more than 2,000 years ago. Some of these constructions are still in use today. Why did they last so long? What was the secret of Roman architecture? Here is the answer. One of the Romans' greatest inventions was the rounded arch, called the Roman arch. And another was cement, a mixture of lime, clay, and water. One of the early uses of the Roman arch was for the construction of aqueducts, which carried water to cities. Usually an aqueduct had several levels of arches. The Romans often placed the larger and wider arches in the bottom row for support, and the smaller and narrower arches were on the top level. Also on the top, they placed a lead U-shaped pipe along which the water flowed, thanks to the pull of gravity. One of the best preserved Roman aqueducts is the Pont du Gard in France. It was built in 19 BCE. The Colosseum remains one of the most impressive monuments to the building genius of the ancient Romans. This huge arena was built around 72 CE 
and had three levels of arches on its exterior. The total height of the construction was approximately 147 feet, 48 meters, and the arena was 259 feet, 79 meters long and 157 feet, 45 meters wide. The theater could hold about 50,000 people. A cloth awning could be spread over the top of the building to protect spectators from the sun. Also, the Colosseum could be air-conditioned by the use of a perfumed spray of water. The Romans left more monuments spread across Europe, the Middle East, and North Africa than any other culture. Can you imagine a modern construction lasting longer than 2,000 years?